having a lovely day. Now, today's video is going to be my spring summer candle collection. Now, I do have loads of candles here, well, for me anyway, and there is no way I think I'm going to burn through all of these in spring and summer, but I thought I'd share with you what I have. Some of the scents on Cold Sniff, obviously I haven't burned them, are absolutely gorgeous, so I wanted to share them with you. Now, I have so many dotted around me, I don't know how I'm going to do this, but I'm going to try. Okay, the first candle I have is from Yankee Candle, and it is Black Coconut. Now this is the scent I didn't get around to burning um, last spring summer, but this is, oh it's lovely cooling, coconutty, musky, salt, water, sea air kind of scent. So, but I have heard really bad reviews about this, so I'm just hoping this one is okay. <laughs> Okay, another I have here from Yankee Candle, which I did not get around to burning, is one of my, well actually I'd say, between this and my Kiki Melon, this is my favourite Yankee Candle, Pink Sands. Now, I think this looks absolutely gorgeous, I love everything about the look of this candle, and the scent is gorgeous, it's like a melon, summer, beaches, I just love it. It's such a hard scent to actually describe unless you smell it yourself, but this is gorgeous. Okay, the next candle I have is from Bath and Body Works. It is a free wick candle in, is it, yeah, Copacabana Beach. Gorgeous looking candle. I really like how this looks. Now this is free wicks. And yeah, I bought this off Yankee Scents for You or somebody else bought it for me of Yankee Scents for You. And it says, Rio's most fashionable spot to sun swim comes to life in a beachy blend of sun kissed coconut, ocean washed, ocean washed driftwood and a hint of sweet tonka. Now, gorgeous scent on cold sniff. It does, it basically, everything it says it smells like, it does on cold sniff. So gorgeous, you know, coconut with the sea air, absolutely gorgeous. And I love how this one looks. Okay, my next one from Bath and Body Works is Caribbean Escape. Another free wick candle and I love how this looks. I think it looks absolutely gorgeous and, oh, gorgeous and fruity and tropical and, oh, just absolutely gorgeous it says dive into this blend of tropical melon raspberry nectar and lemon mellowed by creamy coconut and raw sugar cane absolutely gorgeous it does really it's such a gorgeous scent it really does smell of melon and raspberry to me absolutely gorgeous lovely and tropical okay the next candle i have here is from everyday Lux, and i actually got this from uh, TK Maxx a while back it was under, under four pounds so and this is fresh cut grass now one of these I've melted it was fab another one was absolutely shit so I'm hoping this one performs okay oh and a really really true to life grass scent so this would be good around springtime I think okay the next oh sorry I'm having to lean over everything to get some okay the next candle I have is guava colada and this is the, actually doesn't have a label, but obviously you've got the graduated orange to red wa um, glass. But that's the label there. I just wish they had a label on the front, but this smells absolutely gorgeous. Like guava tr and a tropical, like a guava, gorgeous, tropical oh, cocktail to me. It smells absolutely beautiful. And it says, the intoxicating fragrance of sweet guava mixes golden passion fruit and a rich Pacific Island vanilla. Yeah, absolutely gorgeous. I love how that smells. Oh, sorry, I'm going to have to go come a bit close to get some of these um, candles for you. Okay, the next candle I have here is from Goose Creek. Now, these were on offer on um, the gifting corner for £12. So I had to pick this one up, or some of them up. This is um, strawberry jam and gorgeous bright pinky cerise coloured wax I think it looks absolutely beautiful and I had to just pick this up this is three wicks uh, sorry three two wicks and a nice sweet strawberry scent slightly artificial but not too bad not too bad that one. Oh, sorry I'm just playing around with my phone now <laughs> okay the next candle from Goose Creek is pineapple sea spray and again, I think this looks absolutely beautiful. I love how this one looks. And two wicks again, an absolutely huge jar. I think it's something like 26 ounces or something like that. But absolutely blinking massive. But, oh, I love how this, this is a super duper strong candle. You do pick up on the sea air like a men's cologne with the undertone of pineapple. I think that one is absolutely fantastic. Okay. The next 
candle I have here, and I've had this for young because it's a really small Kringle candle and tangerine. I'm just going to use this as a buffer candle because it's absolutely diddy, but it does smell really quite strong. So who knows? But it's such a diddy candle. I think I'll, I'll try it on its own, but I don't think this is going to work in my living space, and I'll just use it as a buffer candle along with something else. Okay, the next candle I have here is from Caddy's Candles and it is in baby powder. Um, don't be fooled by this, um, I mean she's changed her packaging now actually, this is one of the older candles I've got from her. And the ones I've burnt her have been really pretty good for a tin candle, so I think this would be good for springtime. Oh, Perth, just smells of straight up baby powder, super duper strong, really really strong actually. I can't, you know, and these are so cheap, I think under £4, so absolutely gorgeous scent that one. And I have another one here from Caddy's Candles and as you can see the packaging has changed ever so slightly and this is mango and papaya and this one not as strong as that one this actually is one of the lighter scents I'd say maybe light to medium but it's just smell of mango and papaya it really really does but the baby powder one there is definitely stronger Okay, I'm going to have to get up to get all of these. Okay, my next candle is Watermelon Chiller from Goose Creek Candles. I love how this label looks. Perfect for summertime, nice and bright. I love bright colours. And, oh my God, this smells of straight up melons. Oh, it smells absolutely gorgeous. The watermelons, a lot of like watermelon ice, um, ice creams and that as well, lollies. It smells gorgeous. Can't wait to burn this one. Okay, and my last candle is only a small little candle that somebody got me, but I thought I'd put it in there anyway. It's just one of the little Starburst ones, and I just thought it was really, really cute. So I know they're super duper cheap, and I can't really smell too much of it. It says it's watermelon. A slight undertone of watermelon, but I might burn it alongside my other watermelon candles as well. So, because I don't think that's going to give me too much of a, you know, a scent throw. So, there you go. There's all my spring-summer candles I wanted to show you. Please chat to me on all my social media. I'll